IndyCar. Most lucrative event to happen. Locals who don't like it now go on holiday and rent out their homes for mega bucks. There you go. They're now happy in Thames, say Bob and Bob. Last chance to vote in the poll on the supercars um, should the V8 race take place in central Auckland as planned. Right there in the middle of central Auckland, some of the major thoroughfares, right in the middle of town. 0900 2300 for yes, 0900 2400 for no call to buck. Irritable bowel syndrome, I know, but we've got to discuss it. A very important sort of a thing, you know, for many people, could happen to anybody. Irritable bowel syndrome, around a quarter of us will suffer from it at some point in our lives. So we have to discuss it, you've got to face this one. It can range from embarrassing, unexpected explosions from below. Body burps. B very large body burps. It can become crippling cramps and spasms. It can ruin careers. No doubt it can certainly uh, ruin, or shall we say tarnish, uh, sorry, relationships. New Zealand woman Carol Sinclair says she's found a solution, a no-starch diet. Here's your answer, she. Jen Nolan with Carol Sinclair. So you see, it's not a bad idea. I mean, it's worth trying anything, isn't it, for the irritable bowel syndrome. And, uh, you know, if you're having a little bit of trouble um, uh, there down below, and of course for the arthritis as well, it seems low starch, avoid the starch. Of course, one thing, if you're testing out things with the iodine, don't be uh, eating the iodine. Anyway, you can get more information about the IBS, irritable bowel syndrome, and the gene connected with it by going to Carol's website. There she is, www.lowstarchdiet, one word, dot net. Could uh, solve your problems. Are we having a little bit of trouble with the numbers not adding up quite in the poll? We are fine. So, the results to the poll, it is a most interesting poll result. The question was, should the V8 race take place in Central Auckland as planned? 9,002 votes, and there you go. So that's uh, 3,647 say yes, 5,355 say no. The percentage on that is 41 say yes, but 59% of people polling tonight, nearly 60% say no, shouldn't go ahead as planned in the centre of Auckland. So near enough uh, of a result, I guess, for the battle to be joined to get that race happening in April of 2006. Susan's with you tomorrow night. I'll see you Monday. Those were our people today. That's Homes Tonight. Thank <laughs> you.